Alrighty guys, so I will be having a giveaway on my channel for this month. If you guys are interested in winning a Xbox gift card, a PlayStation gift card, or a Steam gift card, all you have to do to enter is drop a like on the video, comment something down below, and also stay subscribed to the channel. I will be picking a winner through the comment section, so make sure to stay active. Good luck guys, and enjoy the video. Yo, what is going on guys? My name is Rich or right away. Hopefully guys are having a fantastic day and I gotta say right before making this video I was pretty demotivated at just like everything with school and YouTube and then I just literally clicked the record button and now I'm like feeling so much better. I don't know, YouTube just makes me feel really good. But anyway, I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. What I'm going to be talking about today is black sky camo. Black sky camo, the good old amazing looking camo in Infinite Warfare. No, I completely just lied to you guys. This camo is legit dog shit, guys. This camo is dog shit. But I want to talk about why this camo has to change. Why it's so, so important for Infinity War to change this camo into making it look really really nice so i'm going to go over a few points i'm going to go over kind of like a theory of why i think they will change it sometime soon in the future and i just think they really need to change this camo i think they need to make this camo a little bit cooler man so anyway i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you guys do a like rating would be very much appreciated if we can hit 300 likes in the first day man that would absolutely make my day it would make me feel a little bit better i've been feeling a little bit down lately so uh you guys can definitely make me feel a little bit better and uh, if you guys are brand new to the channel make sure to click that subscribe button for some awesome Call of Duty videos each and every day. Also, Control Freak, they just verified the go of my code now being 15% off instead of 10% off. So, I know it's around the holidays. I know you guys might want some Control Freaks for Christmas. Well, my code is now 15% off instead of uh, the uh, the 10% it usually was. So, if you want to save even more money, guys, make sure to use code RAID for a little bit of a discount. 15% now, so make sure to get on that. And if you're interested in free COD points for Infinite Warfare or Black Ops 3, first link down in the description. And with that being said, man, Let's jump right into it. So, the topic of the video, like I said, black sky camo. Supposedly, like, the, the most, like, iconic and, like, the most, like, valuable and the most rare camo in the game, it, it looks terrible. It looks so bad. And I seriously have no clue why. They would make the top camo, the, the camo you have to work the most for, you have to put the most time and effort into this camo, yet it literally looks like dog crap. It looks pretty bad. I think everyone can really agree on it. If I can find some gameplay or even find some pictures, man, I'll have it on the screen right now so I can basically show you guys what this camo looks like and why I'm making it such a big deal. Like, this camo, you have to put so much time and effort into, you have to get diamond for each weapon, including the classic weapons, and to unlock the classic weapon, to unlock all of them, you have to be prestigious nine and you'll have the ability to unlock all of them so you have to grind levels you have to grind camo challenges i know those snipers 160 headshots for the snipers are you kidding me infinity ward are you kidding me so obviously the game has a huge problem the game has a huge problem of you and and them wanting uh, you to work really really hard and put a lot of time and effort into something like the black sky camo but it's not really rewarding like the camo is not rewarding at all i think it even looks really bad like i think some of the black market or like the uh the um hoarder master kind of camos you get out of supply drops are better than the black sky camo is it just me or can you guys agree so um i want to backtrack i want to backtrack actually to black ops 3 because when black ops 3 was first released uh we didn't know about the dark matter camo and that was something really awesome to have a camo in the game that you could not see that we had no clue about i think that's absolutely amazing moving on to infinite warfare right when the game dropped they actually allowed you to use this camo in custom games what? And they even show you guys that the Black Sky camo is there, and that's supposedly the max camo you can get. Why would Infinity Ward make it so you can use that camo in custom games, so you can already see how it looks, and you can see that there's a camo that's like supposedly the dark matter camo of the game why would they do that i don't i just want to mention that i think th i just think that's so foolish of them i think that was such a bad idea of course they made it so you can't use the black sky camo and the solar camo in custom games anymore they removed it which is good but they shouldn't have been in the game day one it shouldn't have been in custom games because now we know what it looks like and Dude, it doesn't even look that good. It, it barely even looks like a camo that should be the top tier camo in the game. So, I think Infinity Ward really messed up there. That was the first part I wanted to talk about. Now, going back to Black Ops 3. So, like I said, when Dark Matter was released, 
it really didn't look that great. And I'll have a picture on the screen right now of what it looks like uh, when it first released. And it literally looks like how Black Sky Camo looks now. Very dull, not a vibrant camo, barely moves, ba just doesn't look like an awesome camo. It's a very dark and grimy kind of purplish camo that really didn't look that great. And of course, Treyarch, they took matters into their own hands and made Dark Matter camo something special. They made something worth grinding for and they made it and they changed it and it looks absolutely awesome now. It's definitely the top tier camo in the game. It's definitely the coolest camo in Call of Duty history, I think, because I just think it, it's so awesome. Dark Matter camo, a secret camo in the game, and they when they updated it and changed the look of it, they did something really good. They made it brighter, they made it more vibrant, they made it more come to life, and I think Treyarch really, really did a good job on that. Moving on to Infinite Warfare. Right now, it is November to, uh, 29th as I'm recording this video, and they still haven't changed the Black Sky camo. Now, one reason why I think they will and they should change this camo is because of the sales and how many people are playing the game. Right now, the sales for Infinite Warfare and the amount of people playing the game right now are really, really low. It's extremely low compared to past Call of Duty games. Everyone knows that. The sales have been down for Infinite Warfare. Um, a lot of more people are actually playing Modern Warfare Remastered than the original kind of new game of this year which is infinite warfare so that's actually kind of crazy but one thing i really think they need to do is change this black sky camo i think if they updated the camo i think if they made it something worth grinding for i think it would give more people of an, of an incentive to actually play the game and put some time into it because i feel like i'm grinding headshots and i'm grinding all these challenges and at the end i'm thinking i'm gonna get a camo that doesn't even look that great you know so that's the thing it makes people stop wanting to grind go for those camos actually you know grind levels to get all those classic weapons because the camo that they're trying to get it's not a good camo and the solar camo the camo right before it's so how to get solar is you have to get diamond for each weapon not including the classic weapons so you wouldn't have to get to prestige 9 to actually get solar camo you can get solar camo literally at, per, at per, like the first prestige you know because you don't have to prestige to unlock those classic weapons the classic weapons are not included for solar camo and why you know you know prestige and go to like level uh, prestige 9 to unlock all those classic weapons for black sky when you could just get solar the first prestige because it looks so much better man i mean solar they updated the solar camo they they forgot about black sky they updated the solar camo and solar looks so cool so people are grinding for solar and not black sky which it should be the other way around like solar looks absolutely amazing it's such a nice vibrant yellow come to life kind of camo it looks absolutely amazing has those yellow yellows has those reds and orange mixed into it it moves it's animated it looks like a fantastic camo then we go to black sky supposedly the top camo in the game and it looks so crappy so i think that infinity war needs to update this camo i think they need to change this camo not just not just because you know they they really need to change this camo like it's not a good looking camo but another reason of making people want to play the game more because i think a lot of people would play infinite warfare a lot more if they had an incentive to get a, an awesome looking camel towards the end which is black sky and now that people know what it looks like um i think like maybe a couple people have actually unlocked black sky like legitimately in multiplayer um i think people actually see gameplay with it and they're just like you know what? i don't want to go for that camo like that camo doesn't look that good but when people saw dark matter in black ops 3 they were like okay i want this camo this camo looks like the coolest camo in the game I gotta get my hands on this camo, man. I have to get my hands on this camo. And that's how I felt. That's how I felt with Dark Matter. I was like, this camo is the coolest camo in the game, man. And I want to get my hands on it. And with Infinite Warfare, I don't have that same kind of feeling. I don't have that same drive to grind and grind and grind all those hours just to get a camo that's not the greatest camo in the world. So, so I'm going to have Infinity Ward in the title of this video. So every time you like it, it will send it to their way. And I think they should really see this video. And if by any chance, anyone at Infinity Ward is watching this video, you. please 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 not just from me but from a lot of people who think that black sky is a really bad looking camo please update it man because i think if you update the camo it gives more people of an incentive to play it gives more people to go for those camo challenges and i think changing this camo could really change the game a lot and it would make people want to play the game it would make people maybe even want to buy the game for christmas like i know christmas time a bunch of people get this game for christmas which is totally understandable and those people are kind of called christmas noobs Either way, it's totally fine if you get the game for Christmas. I encourage you to get the game for Christmas, but it's just crazy how, like, when people go on, they're just like, oh, Black Sky Camo, that 
doesn't even look that great like why why would i grind for that camo you know what i mean so i think it's going to be very very important uh, if infinity ward actually changes this camo it would be a freaking a major move it'd be a major win for them if they do make this camo look a lot nicer and some of the things they can do is just brighten it a little bit because it's so damn dark so even just like the slightest thing you could just brighten the camo and it would look a little bit better maybe add some purples maybe add it so more it's more vibrant more animated just come to life god Damn it, just come to life, people. No, but in all seriousness, I think that uh, Infinity Ward, they really need to change this camo. Not just to change the camo because the camo looks bad, but also to kind of uh, keep their game going, keep their game more to life. So anyway, I wanted to make this video to talk about the real reason why Infinity Ward will and probably change this camo because they're smart over there, man. I do I do have some faith in Infinity Ward. So guys, if you're over there, man, I have some faith in you. Uh, do me good, do me right, and uh, change the camo, change the camo. But anyway, thank you so much for watching today's video. Video. If you guys somehow enjoyed my voice and my theory and my kind of rant about how this camo looks like complete dog shit Then make sure to drop a like guys. It only takes two seconds out of your day Also, if you're brand new to the channel, uh, make sure to click that subscribe button. all subscriptions uh, It's free. It's free to subscribe and also it, it, so it shows that you guys are supporting my channel It shows that you guys really want to support me in the long run. We're on the road to 100k So thank you guys so so much and if you're interested in free cod points Like I said first link down in the description make sure to check that out and uh with that all being said, I'll see you all on another one. Hey, what's going on, guys? I wanted to let you know that I'm actually teaming up with a couple of other YouTubers. We have Dr. Pineapples, Quantum FT, E. Cola Espresso, Long Sensation, a couple of others, and we're all teaming up to be giving away a nice giveaway for Infinite Warfare. Uh, we're actually going to be giving away a Legacy Edition copy of Infinite Warfare to you guys, as well as three G Fuel tubs. So if you're interested in winning a Legacy Edition for Infinite Warfare, as well as maybe even some G Fuel, you guys can click the first link down in the description. All you have to do is pretty much fill out your email and then subscribe to the channels that I listed and that's pretty much it so there will be four winners in total one person will be the top winner and you will win in the legacy edition for infinite warfare as well as three runner-up winners uh, and you guys will actually pick a flavor of G fuel and we'll actually send it to you so hopefully you guys enjoy that uh, make sure to enter into the giveaway thank you guys so much and I'll see you later